patient is prescribed 5,000 mg's, 5,000 mg's of a medication prescribed. Medication is available as one gram per one mil. How many milliliters uh, should the nurse administer? So this is a volume question, or volume formula, which we should know by now, is what, what we want divided by what we or you got multiplied by the volume available. Now, before we load up the formula, we need the same units to go in here and here. But look, our units here are mg's and here is grams. So we have to convert one of these. So first unit, we've done our unit check. We need to convert large to small is usually what we do. So we're going to convert one gram equals how many milligrams. And from earlier, we've memorized that going from grams to milligrams, we multiply by 1,000. So one gram multiplied by 1,000 gives us 1,000 milligrams. This here now is what we got. That's what's on the shelf. 1,000 milligrams floating in one mil of the fluid. So our volume V equals 5,000. That's what we want. That's prescribed. 5,000 mg's divided by 1,000 mg's multiplied by the volume available, 1 mil. These guys cancel. 5,000 divided by 1,000. Well, we can cancel. We can divide above and below by 1,000. 5 over 1 is 5. You get 5 times 1 mil. And that is 5 mils. Does that answer make sense? It does. If we give them 1 mil, they receive 1 gram or 1,000 mg's. Give them 5 mil, they receive 5 grams, which is equivalent to 5,000 mg's. So I'm happy with this answer here. Don't forget to pause, practice, subscribe and like. Thank you.